Lilith won't let me. And God said to Lilith, you bitch, let her be on top. And she said, fuck you, God. And God said, well, if you don't let me be on, you don't let her, um, Adam be on top. This is a true story. It's the process of Adam. This is her story. I am definitely. Then, that's an honor. she says, screw you. Isn't she saying fuck you to God? Basically by her mom. Yeah. She's living this story. This is her story. Who am I to try to get her to change? I'm just educating the client, bringing awareness. And then she was sent to exile. And every day she birthed thousands of kids. And every night she swallowed her kids at night. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. And that was the story of Lilith in mythology. And that story, you tell that to a client, and you go, you know, you're simply just the archetype. We have our archetypes around here. You're simply just the archetype of Lilith. You're simply just living out this story. You don't ever have to change. Just be aware that you exist in mythology. You can show her a picture. I don't have a, a Lilith, you know, I sort of image. Now, though. I'm Mary Magdalene. Okay, well, Mary Magdalene is Lilith in Christianity. They're the same figure. That's why no matter which mythology you read, whether it's African mythology, whether it's Japanese mythology, whether it's Nordic mythology, doesn't matter. Christian mythology, they all have the same characters. There's only a certain number of characters. You are wearing a costume. My job as a therapist is to either applaud your costume and make you aware that you're wearing the prostitute costume, help you integrate that costume, and then maybe get you to do certain things differently, like fight a little less with your mom, maybe, so that you're not so agitated, or so that your son isn't like this, and your son lives a better life. But our goal is to bring awareness to the client of what their thoughts are that are self-destructive. If you get more than that, hey, applause, applause. That's why using symbol is so important because people speak in symbol. Color is symbol. Keys on a keychain, on a on a necklace is a symbol. Yes. All right. So I won't be here Thursday because I got an appointment. I won't can either. I'm having can surgery. Can we please? I'm not going to be here Thursday. I'm yes, having surgery. Exactly. What time is it? Okay, okay, so what we'll do just so that Tanisha and those of you can get the elements. Okay, so two, Ms. Rapachi's going to be here Thursday. You're still required to come. Mm -hmm. She'll be teaching. What we're going to do now is just get the element, the symbol of the element of water, air, earth, or fire. Next week when I'm back, on Tuesday, we're going to go through the psychology of each of the elements. You can do this before your client gets here. So who has a chart? Here, uh, I have my chart. Okay. <laughs> so these symbols are all the archetypes. You're only going to use 10 symbols, OK? So you should only have 10. You are not going to use the circle with the x or the circle with the square. I'm going to tell you the ones you're not going to use, and then you're going to use all the other ones, and I'll go around to help you. You're not going to use the nodes, the ones that look like a U and an N. So you're not going to use this or this. You're not going to use this one or this one. You're not going to use this, and you're not going to use that. That should leave you 10. Okay? Venus. Uranus, Pluto, Sun, Moon, Mercury, Mars, Neptune, and Saturn. That's the one I wanted. That one interesting. The Black Moon. Oh, she's the best. She's my bitch. <laughs> that's my birthday. Okay. Oh, the Black Moon's your birthday? Ooh! Okay, but that's not the one we're looking at today. Today we're looking at the elements. This is the way to know the psychology of your client. You don't need their birth time. So on an intake, you're going to ask the person's birthday. You can run this for free on the computer, and you can add these up. So you're going to look at the colors. Everybody should have red, brown, 
a light aqua, and a dark blue. These are all red, but you're not counting that one. So you have one, two, three, red. What are the so colors again? Three, red, which is fire. You're going to have red is fire. Light blue or aqua is air. Dark blue is water. And brown is earth. I got an orange color. I don't know. The element that you're, you have in the largest quantity is going to talk about the way that you resolve conflict and create conflict. Where do you have orange? No, that, not that. This. <laughs> These. You're not looking at the main planets. You're looking at the little ones. Those symbols. Yeah, you're counting these little ones here, not the big ones on the outside. Exactly. So count the number of red that you have. Count the number of light aqua. Count the number of dark blue and count the number of brown. You should only have ten. Because you're not counting these. Okay, what's the next color? A little more sun. Red, light aqua. So you have one, two, three, three. So put fire, air. Fire is red. So you want to do yours, Mr. Pachi? Okay. You're going to add up these little ones. Where's yours? Oh, he needs brown. Oh, you want to take a picture of it? Come. So how many, Trisha, you had how many fire? I have three fire. How many air? I have three. How many water? It's the dark blue. Um, this is the little water looking thing, right? This one. No, that one's in air. Oh, that's air. So you have so four air. This must be brown. I don't know these colors. I don't. And you should only add up to ten. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. How about, about when they're purple? Purple. purple? Uh, dark purple is like a blue birthday. Okay, that makes sense yeah. now. I got it. Okay, so it's really And I'm guessing this gold is just brown. It's what? What time? You don't know for sure? Okay. And today we don't know the exact time. I got 11. I counted it wrong. So. Three. 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 You got your time? Yeah. I don't think For I today, does it matter? Yeah. That you do not need the time. That's what's so good about this. I got 11. I don't think I did this right. Okay, that means that you counted one of these. Do not count the nodes. Do not count the earth. Do not count the wheel of fortune. Do not count. Do not count. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have none of those. In the middle? So yes, so you should only have 10. Okay. This is red. One. Two red, three, three red, four red. Oh, I ain't even go around, so I got so, way more. <laughs> so four fire. Trisha, how many dark blue do you have? Uh, I ain't you don't even have the chart. Okay, if you don't have any dark blue or any of an element, it's going to explain something. That's super important for the psyche of the person. You're missing an element. And how many brown? One, two. That one doesn't count. Two, and that one doesn't count. Two. Oh my God. No, you're missing something. Where do we go? You should have ten. The ones in between. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, fire. Oh, you do have a dark blue. Here's one. Okay, now we're talking. So Trisha has three fire, four 
there one water, two earth. What's her main element? Air. 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 This is going to be the way she creates conflict psychologically. And we're going to do this on Tuesday. We'll go through all of the traumas and we'll go through all of that stuff. There's for each element. I'll help every one of you calculate. Don't worry. You're not going to leave here without knowing how. But I just want to know, show you. You can do this before your client gets to your office. And you can already know that they are going to speak with a certain element. So Wendy, I think, when you showed me yours, had a lot of air. I think your main element is air. So intellect, intelligence, speaking, logic are going to be elements of the air. Same as you. Can you have some, can you have, can you be missing one of those qualities? You could be missing, okay. yes. And if someone is missing something, it is going to tell you something about their psychology. She has very little water. She's going to deal with emotion in a very difficult way. Because she's not going to have enough element to help her. We're going to go through each one in the psychological conflict. Yes. No, not the same one. No, I mean the dark one. It does say we have dominant elements, which are based on the position of the planets and the angles of the 12 signs. And what surprised me is that. Fire was actually my highest element. Yeah, but I don't know how many planets you have. That's why I'm having you count it manually on the one I did, because each program is different. Okay? So my program, if I went by that, the one I have here, it would say a lot more, because it would be counting the six. So that's why I need to make sure that you're only counting the main Bs. You're only counting the main archetypes Minus Chiron. So all of these are the only ones you should be counting. No Earth, no Chiron. There's ten. Who needs help? Me. Yeah, we did me. Okay. <laughs> Everybody need help. Okay. That's Aqua. That's awkward, but we don't count it. So you have one air. One air. One air. Earth is going to be your main one because you can see here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six Earth. Okay. So that's seven or is there any three more? One water. Two water. Yes. No. Oh, this one. This one. One fire. Okay, who else? I can't even see that. When I print them out for you, it'll be easier. Okay, let's start with your earth. One, two, three, three earth. One aqua, two, three. No, no, we're just looking in here. Three aqua. What do you have? Six? Okay. Water one. Yeah, the side. Two. Three water. And what's it? A fire? One. One fire. Okay. Do you get it, Mr. Pachis? Oh my god, I got ten. <laughs> so count only these. Right. That's what we're talking about. So two rounds. Three rounds, four rounds. This one you don't want. Yeah. So I've got three ears. Yes. Okay, dark water, you've got one. Three ears. One, I got that one. Is water. Okay, so air, there. you've got one, two, three, because you don't count this one. Three. Where did you work? Oh, okay, three. So that's seven, eight, 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 like the office is in danger of like that. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Okay. What did so you mean? Three, six, four. Okay. What did I mean? <laughs> okay. One, I had two, two, two water. I just got it because two it was meant to be. But I had nothing. I had no degree, no experience, nothing. Five air. Well, like, oh, well, like, that's the good well, thing. Like, yeah, I got that. You know, five I love air. Kids. Makes sense. I was wondering where Pisces was. I want to be the best. 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 I want to be the
Um, three fire. First, I went to three by Pfizer. Like eight, ten. Like so you have no. So I kept like calling them. No work. No. Then no no I got a hold of your HR. I think you know her. Then I started like, emailing her. And then I have one. I got lots of people. I don't like help. You need to hang out with Earth people. She. Like tree huggers. I remember that. She yes, tree yeah. but yeah. I think yeah. she yeah. She's very honest with me. Like she asked me, why should I give you this job? To her. And I answered. And after that, she said, to anyone ever ask me <laughs> what would be the perfect answer for this question, I would say what you just said. So you just give me the perfect answer. Thank you so much. And I was like, well. Oh. You're welcome. So, see, so, the balance of water and air. You have things like that where you're alike, that's actually very positive. <laughs> okay. But they say, I think they do need four Earth, five Earth. You ain't going nowhere, girlfriend. You are here. You're not dying anytime soon. One, two, Three fire. What is that? Eight. Okay. I know it's going to hurt me in the beginning, but. One water and one air. Me, me, me. Mama, mama, me. Where's your printout? It's literally right here. Okay. One fire. I got four fire. Three, four fire. Okay. One, two, two water. Two water. Two earth. No. How many do you have? Four, five, six, seven, eight. There's only two left. Two earth. These don't count. Remember I said the car on the black moon, the earth, and the nose don't count. These two. Two air. Two earth. Should equal ten. Everyone should equal ten. Mr. Pond, do you want to help her? Yes. And then I'll double check. That made perfect sense. Okay, one, two, three, four air. And you don't talk enough in class with four air. You should be talking all the time. Because I give my work It's okay. One earth. You have a lot to say, and you're very smart about it. Two earth. Two fire. How much is that? A couple of months to get a home. Yeah. And the only reason they probably got back to me is because I was missing like, water. I was walking the One <laughs> water. Where's your hair? Okay, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You're missing one. Two Earth. One, two, three, four, five, air. Oh, can you help her? 
Oh, where's your chart? And how many had Earth? Okay, a lot of Earth. Okay. Okay. So what we're gonna do on Tuesday, bring your breakdown. I'm gonna tell you what each of these mean, what professions you're likely to get into. Remember, you're gonna have therapists and clients for all different kinds of things. And they might ask you what is a good profession, or they tell you some interest and you have it. We're gonna tell, talk about the archetype. Are you the martyr archetype? Are you the prostitute archetype? Are you the land baron archetype? Okay. What? It was a face. Not you. <laughs> Not you, because you're missing the earth element. Oh, yeah. And we're going to talk about the psychological conflict. What Are you more of an anger? Are you more of a person that fluctuates with their emotions? Yes. It's okay. I'm not bad to catch on. That's okay. I'm going to explain the polarities. You know what's funny is I just want to. But you said they need you, but you found out more information. I'm not sure. You know, I never see my cords. Like, I don't have cords. No.